Okay, Chef Shankar, it's a pleasure to meet you. Tell me about yourself and your in your presence here. My name is Keshava. Uh, my presence here was here because of a very wonderful soul. I, I only had a moment association with him. I went with him in two programs and played tabla with him. But um, just being with him alone, I could recognize after my whole life of studies in, in Sastra and Vedas, I grew up in a Brahmin family. I could recognize that this person was not an ordinary person. As right? um, I said in Bhagavad Gita chapter 10, that sometimes I choose who gets bhakti or who gets love and who doesn't get love. And he had so much love in his heart. Love is developed by, by hearing, always hearing the uh, bhajans, which is like the essence of the Vedas. And also chanting these, uh, these glories. So love is developed like that. Uh, Later on in my life, I, I got a scholarship to India and I have five awards for classical singing, uh, semi classical. Uh, I got first place, uh, pure classical, second place. And then I did um, Hindi and I did uh, dance also. <laughs> so um, I, I learned a lot in India and I developed myself. Uh, through a scholarship by the Indian High Commissioner. And I spent another year also here uh, in the holy places of pilgrimage. Tell me something, how do, do, does it, in your opinion, is there a bright future for Indian culture? Yes, I believe so very well. Actually, it is it's predicted in the Gita also that um, yeah, Hinduism, uh, we, will, we will go on again in this age and time, uh, we, uh, we call culture, kal me da, la, right? Yo. We will go on again for another 700 years, like that. but eventually it will fade. Yeah, in, in this time, uh, everything but uh, how to say what I see in India and all over the world that many people not only Indian people but uh, white people people from Ghana black people I, I met people from all over the world they come to India especially to hear about this Vedic culture why because this, this science is actually working for everyone it is an effective method of understanding God and of perfecting our life so your Indian experience was a pleasant one. Sorry? Your Indian experience yeah. was quite pleasant. Quite pleasant. Right? Learning yeah. experience. Yeah, I've experienced everything, the good, the bad and the ugly, as I said. Yeah. Okay, Kishab, thank you very much.